morning guys it is thursday morning i have not turned on the camera for a little bit sun is not working with me today but anyways happy thursday it is almost friday i want to say real quick this movie unbroken patch redemption this actually no there's two movies so this is the first movie called unbroken sorry the sun is like right there and the second one is the path to redemption sequel part two movie two this movie is so good i highly highly recommend you guys go see this or not go see but like you know borrow the movie or buy the movie or rent the movie whatever you want to call it watch this movie this movie is actually based on a true story about a guy named louis zamberini he is a war hero war veteran like amazing true real life hero like his story is unbelievable or i shouldn't say unbelievable it's incredible really incredible the things that he went through and he still made it in the end like it's crazy louis zamperini was an italian american and he went into war during world war ii he actually died when he was 97 years old like so super blessed to live a long life based on all the things that he went through in his life like incredible just i can't like there's not the words to say and i was like glued to the tv i'm like oh my gosh i will say during like the first movie the part there's a part in the movie that kind of gets a little bit like okay like can we just fast forward just a little bit um but i mean during that portion they do kind of do flashbacks as well so that did help i just felt like that part was a little bit long um but overall just absolutely incredible like please watch this movie if you want to be inspired this is a true based on a true story like this is his life like the things he went through completely amazing anyways watch this movie good morning guys happy monday i am going to have a good day that's how we're going to start this vlog we are going to have a good day and we're going to accomplish things that we need to accomplish today so the plan today is i have a interview that is coming up tomorrow and I just need to kind of like get myself prepped for it so what I want to do later on today at some point is to go through and like write down some questions that I feel like I'll be asked and because I already kind of have idea um, what the questions are going to be um, like the subject of the questions so I think I'm gonna go and try to formulate some questions that I think I'll be asked and then like answer them so that way I can be prepared as prepared as can be and then also I have a meeting on Wednesday which I am a bit nervous for so I also want to create questions for that meeting as well um, and I also kn know what it's going to be about and you know just sometimes like people always there's like always that saying that people say is not about what you say but how you say it so I don't want to like say something that is going to like trigger other things when that's not what I'm intending or intent to mean so the same thing again I want to create questions so that way I can be somewhat prepared for that meeting but anyways um other than that tonight is also the bachelorette so I'm excited to watch tonight oh my gosh this guy is just like what's his name Luke oh I just want him off the show like seriously off the show like Luke is just no he needs to go bye bye I think he's just like there to waste Hannah's time like and he's just being so unrealistic I think he's trying to be like that romantic guy like in the movies and like trying to say and not do but like say try to say the right things and he's just not no it's not working Luke I'm sorry it's it just isn't can you believe we are like almost at the end this is like the final week of june like i cannot believe it like this is just insane and what next week is july i can't i can't wait for uh, july for it because then we get a day off so <laughs> that is um always something to look forward to so i'm excited for that i don't have any plans but um yeah just a day off is nice because my last day off i didn't actually get to like do anything like i just was a lazy bum literally 
I need to do my nails. I think I want to do kind of like this color pink, like a very whitish, pale pink versus a fuchsia. Do you guys ever feel like sometimes when you're driving, some people just just as being slow just to like get on your nerves <laughs> anyways guys have a lovely monday and i'll see you later good morning guys happy wednesday it is going to be a good day today because we're going to start off positive and think positively and expect uh good things and if something negative or bad um falls into play for you today don't let it be a discouragement don't let it keep you down and just work through it so for today i am gonna actually have a relaxing day i feel like the last two days my mind has just been all over the place because i've had a couple things that i have had to do and it just took consumed my mind a lot so i think after today i'll be able to just be like you know <laughs> decompress today we're wearing pink because on wednesdays we wear pink right if you don't know where that's from go watch mean girls you just have to it's a classic today i'm gonna put on my lip this kylie lipstick or liquid it's a liquid velvet or velvet liquid i can't talk velvet liquid lipstick this is in the color charm and it's just like a perfect kind of like a mauvey pinky color I will put it on for you guys when I get a chance to like stop at a light because every light today wants to be green which is interesting because the days when you don't want the lights to be uh, red like every light is red and when you actually want a red light it's like come on now I'm waiting for one <laughs> do you guys get nervous when you do like interviews so yesterday I had an interview with, with people I know which is interesting maybe that makes it harder because you know the people and you kind of like know what they're what they know about you already and what they kind of what they expect I guess so I think maybe that's why it was harder you would think I'd be more comfortable but it was definitely harder and I think it went well but I was so nervous and initially like after the conversation was like going then I I got more comfortable and it wasn't so bad anymore but initially like I was so nervous like so so nervous what are some things that you guys do when you're prepping for an interview how much research and time do you put into it and what are your expectations from interviews for me like again i haven't done it in so long but for this one it was something that i was kind of familiar with but at the same time you know i think the main thing with interviews is that it's all about you and at the feel sometimes it's hard to talk about you as a person versus talking about somebody else like it's easier to talk about you know your neighbor or you know your friend or a family member like it's easier to say oh well you're amazing you did this and blah 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 whereas if it's yourself you're kind of like i don't want to come off like a narcissist or so i don't know i just kind of find it harder but i gotta get going so i'm gonna park real quick and then show you guys my lip color and then i have to get going So real quick before I put my shades up, this is the lip color in Charm from Kylie. A liquid lip, liquid velvet lipstick, whatever, you know what I'm saying. But I have to get going, so see you guys later.